Top 10 Craziest Things You Can Do in Worm In the realm of MMOs, Worm has always stood out for its quirky charm and deep gameplay. It has never been one to conform to what other MMOs were doing. Thus, you will find a lot of weird and wonderful hidden features and things that you can do that you would just never see in other MMOs. Today, we're going to count down the 10 craziest things you can do in Worm. A big thanks goes out to the Worm community who helped me figure out many of the things we'll see in this video. Starting with number 10, live on a mountain peak. Lots of MMOs have player housing, but usually it's quite restricted on where you can build or live. In Worm, however, you can build your house on any unclaimed land, even if it's on the very top of a mountain. In Worm, you can truly be the king of the castle. Number 9. Spawn an Island In the old days, by completing a series of personal goals, you could get something called the Wand of the Seas that would allow you to spawn your very own island. Although that game mechanic has since changed, you'll still find players selling them from time to time. Apparently they can still be found on the Epic PvP server as well, and even if you never get your hands on one, there's nothing stopping you from dumping a whole bunch of dirt into the sea and creating your island that way. Absolutely doable, although it would be a lot of work of course. How many MMOs do you know where you can create your very own island? Amazing! Number 8. Put weird things in your character's hands. As with most RPGs, you can of course equip your character's hand slots with things like swords, shields, and so forth. Some MMOs, such as World of Warcraft, allow you to also equip so-called offhand items, such as flowers or lanterns. In Worm, however, you can put pretty much anything into your character's hands. Why settle for swords or flowers when you could be holding a pair of pumpkins? Number 7 catapult dead cows into the sky. Yes, in Worm, you can build your very own catapult. Most people use stone shards as ammunition, but did you know that you can also load and fire corpses? Annoy your neighbors by catapulting dead cows all over the place. Or if you're on the PvP side, why not break down a fort with the bodies of your enemy? Number 6. Pull a beating heart out of a corpse. In Worm, pretty much every item has its own 3D model that can be set on the ground or even placed on a table. This includes items you get upon butchering, such as teeth, bladders, horns, paws, and even hearts. The special thing about hearts, though, is that they have a beating animation that goes on forever and ever. It looks pretty cool and creepy, but take that one step further by combining 64 hearts together, and you'll get a gigantic beating heart. The perfect gift for your sweetie pie on Valentine's Day. Number 5. Decorate stuff with googly eyes. Remember when I mentioned that you get body parts from butchering corpses? This also includes eyeballs. We all love to stick those plastic googly eyes onto objects and make them look silly. Well now you can do it virtually in an MMO as well. The one person who really brought this into the limelight was Fabricant, a googly eye grand master, and also a fellow worm streamer. If you want to see him in action, I will include a link to his Twitch profile in the description below. Number 4. Create Hell on Earth Have you ever wanted to see the whole world incinerated and reduced to molten lava? Well in Worm you can do exactly that with the Fire Pillar command. Open your console by pressing F1, write in the fire pillar command, and press enter, and voila, the tile beneath you will instantly turn to lava. Well, almost. In reality, it's merely a visual effect, and won't burn you like an actual lava tile would. It's only visible to you and for as long as your client is open. Still, a cool trick though if you want to take crazy screenshots or mark the land temporarily for practical purposes. Number 3. Take your friend on a unicorn ride. Unlike other mountable animals in Worm where you ride solo, the unicorn has a special hidden feature. Namely, you can embark on one as a passenger, allowing you to ride tandem with a friend. 
go exploring the world together, or start a medieval taxi service, the possibilities are limitless. Number two, sail the seas on a crocodile. In addition to unicorns, Worm also allows you to ride horses, cows, and even bears. But did you know that you can ride crocodiles as well? And unlike other mounts which only travel on land, riding a crocodile will allow you to ride right into the water and it will swim on the surface. Who needs boats when you can sail the seas with your very own crocodile? Before we reveal the number one crazy thing you can do in Worm, let's have a look at a few honorable mentions. You can throw chestnuts at people and get funny messages. You can pass gas with the fart emote. You can play with toys such as performing puppet shows and doing rad tricks with yo-yos. The game even has an actual skill for it. You can cast courier on a well and it will turn into a wishing well. Worm has tons of crazy things to discover and I could go on and on, but let's now look at the final item on our list. Number one. Create a minefield of sharks. Do you have a problem with people trespassing on your property? Is it time to upgrade your home security? You could build walls, plant thorn bushes, or lay traps, but why stop there? Why not go all out by creating a shark minefield? All you have to do is create pockets of water, lure some sharks into them, and cover them with dirt. You'll never have to deal with nosy neighbors again. This crazy idea of making land sharks is all thanks to McCoofer, another fellow worm streamer. You can also check his link in the description below. Do you know of other crazy things you can do in worm? I'd love to hear about them, so please leave a comment and tell us all about it. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you've never played worm before but enjoy sandbox MMOs, you can play the game at wormonline.com. I hope to see you there.